All right, we are live. Hello, and welcome to the Belief Buffet, a weekly opportunity to share some thoughts. Some weeks it is some genius idea that has downloaded from the divine. Some weeks I am struggling to get my bearings and get out of a funk. And some days it's a little bit on the fly. And uh, yesterday, in the week previous, I was in a bit of a funk. Today I'm feeling much better. And I think the topic of the day is going to be just that, about the ebb and flow, about how life is this journey of ups and downs. It is that roller coaster and such a powerful tool of surviving and appreciating and not making the challenges worse is that awareness of the journey and that with up times there is down times and with down times they are temporary. I actually had a, uh, a tarot reading last night which is not normally my thing but the woman offered who is a, a powerful woman and uh, has lots to share and so and I was in a place of kind of despair and down and just like hey uh, you know can't hurt actually first I tried to encourage I was like I'm in a bad space maybe it's not the right time and she was in, insistent and I was like okay 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 and so uh, and the, the real gist of the reading was that uh, I'm in the middle of struggles and there's this kingly, king's wisdom that is just around the corner. And, 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 and that was really powerful for me to hear because that's kind of what subconsciously is what I've really been focusing on and really being like, it's okay that I'm not in the best space over this last week. A week ago or a week and a half ago, I was Woo! I just, I mean, I went to the Bequinox event last weekend. And so Monday when I was doing this broadcast a week ago, I was still charged up on what an incredible experience I had. And then I, I, I hit the wall with energy and just the, the, the cycles, the ebb and flow. And so this is, this, this last week has been one of really trying to allow not to get too bummed out or too frustrated by the lack of energy trying to to practice self-care maybe a little bit too much self-care in like the self-indulgent letting myself watch all sorts of netflix shout out russian doll shout out ozark uh, both enjoyed very much the second seasons of those um and letting myself eat a little bit too much. That is one of my tendencies. I tend to, to comfort eat. And not exercising. And so I, I have been allowing myself to, to go through this chapter uh, without too much judgment. Now I have been, been very focused on not uh, having a cocktail, trying to just not fully escape this experience that I'm going through. I recognize that, you know, social media and, and Netflix and food are other types of escape, but maybe a different level, at least in my mind. So, um, so I'm, my my lesson of the week or my I, my belief buffet this week is is trying to stay in that appreciation of the ebb and flow of ideas and energy and inspiration appreciate the roller coaster journey appreciate um, that the way things look in this moment may or may not um, be the way they look tomorrow and so having some some patience and some understanding some forgiveness 
and maybe even delaying some decisions. You know, I, I woke up this morning thinking like, I'm not gonna do Belief Buffet today. I think I'm, maybe I'm gonna take a break. I think I'm gonna take a break from making YouTube videos. I think I'm gonna, I'm gonna take a break from these morning love broadcasts I'm doing. I'm just gonna, I think I'm just, I, just, I need to, I need to take a break. And that may or may not be true, but I wanna make that decision not from a place of frustration or depression or, or, um, you know, glass half empty thinking. So ebb and flow is a lesson for the day. Ah, and thank you for joining me. Thank you for allowing me a space to ebb and to flow. I love you.